children in this part of video i am going to discuss the program which you have got as a homework few children have tried very well but few of you have made a little bit of mistake in putting the condition if condition so children uh, i am going to discuss the program which was for your homework so let us see the question was write a program to enter any natural number or a some integer number and check whether it is an even number or an odd number so here i have written the basic structure of the program so the according to the question it is asking from the user to enter any natural number so we will take a data type int and then n is equal to 0 here i have taken n as a variable where i store the natural number now see out i am asking the value from the user so here i am writing please enter any natural number now for next line n i'll use you can use endel also if you want you use endel or slash n now c in to input the value of n n semicolon now if so if you want to find the even number so what is the logic of even number even numbers are divisible by 2 hence remainder will be zero so how do we get that no there is no remainder so uh, n modulus 2 and then what generally mistake children has made that they had put single equal sign so here children we have to use double equal signs okay and then we'll write zero because if the number is divisible by 2 and there is no and it's equal to 0 then it is it will be a even number so here we will put the curly bracket if you want to skip you can skip also so see out and then here we'll write if condition is true then we will write here n you can write in any uh, way but here i am using the value also so we'll see is an even number okay now semicolon and curly brace close if the condition is false if it is if there na n is uh not divisible by 2 then and it and it sorry remainder is coming so the next condition is c out it will print we'll use curly bracket first then c out what c out n we'll keep it out n is an odd number semicolon brace close curly brace and then get ch now we'll compile the program and if we find any error try to debug it so no errors now control f9 to run the program so please enter any natural number so i am entering the number 22 okay so 22 is an even number this condition is true so it is printing the first statement let us check the another statement of it so here i am printing 67 giving the value as a 67 67 is an odd number so now the second condition is true 
So this way, children, we have to do this program. And you just see here what we have used. N modulus 2 equal equal to 0. Okay. So now children, if you want to save your program, how do you save? Go to file, say save. Then this dialog box will come. File save as. And here you can, uh, by default, its name is coming no name 04. Okay. So you can give your own name. Here the whole path is coming and here I will write the name odd, odd even, okay, dot extension cpp. This is the C++ files extension and say okay. So you can see the name has come as odd even dot cpp. Now if you want to close, you say here. Thank you children and 